That's me done for the week. 40 minute run. Lovely through the dunes on the beach of Langenis in West Wales. Stunning. Look at this weather. Bank holiday weekend as well. It's never happened. being pretty tired this week due to uh, a sudden load of creative work that's come in. So it's a lot of work to do but it's, it's really exciting work but it's kind of increased my workload and I'm even working whilst we're away this uh, this weekend in Fangenis. But uh, yeah, I'm pretty tired I have to admit but I managed to hit all my goals apart from the bike again. It seems to be so much harder to get the turbo sessions in when we're away on the weekend. But I did my two runs, I increased my 400 meter intervals to seven this week, from five last week and three the week before that, obviously now up to nine next the week after that. Increased my long easy run, which I've just finished, out in the dunes to 40 minutes, 50 minutes next week. So that's all going well, the swimming's going superbly. Um, I swam four times this week, managed to get to the university session on the Thursday morning that was canceled last time. But on a Wednesday night, I went to the session in Porter's Head again and uh, there was a CSS test. Now, if you don't know what CSS test is, I'll put a link to the information for that below. But basically, it's just a, a test that you do a 400 meter flat out swim and then you have some recovery and then you do a 200 meter flat out swim. And there's an algorithm that works out what your threshold time should be for about 1500 meters um, from that. And I did one back in January and uh, I think I swam something like 6.10 for the 400 and on Wednesday I smashed my PB down to five, uh, 5.48 so it's about 126, 127 per 100 for 400 and uh, the 200 I equaled my PB um, which is 2.48 and uh, I was swimming with uh, some of the swimmers that I really look up to and uh, that's a huge result for me, I have to say. It's given me a huge mental boost. And basically it just comes down to a couple of simple things really. A couple of simple things that I sort of set in motion a few weeks ago with that video, the uh, sort of slightly tongue in cheek, James Hester is a swimmer video, uh, James the swimmer video. Um, but that was the intention was to set out and basically establish myself more in my own mind as a swimmer. And all I did was to swim five times a week. I had no goals for times or anything like that had an idea for distance and wanted to swim about 10k over those five days and I achieved those things but the results performance wise were really big off the back of that and I'm applying that simply to my running now I'm kind of not really worrying about times or pace or anything especially not in uh, environments like this there's not much you can do in terms of being able to run fast in environments like this but just running 40 minutes just running on my feet and just doing those reps of 400 around the block. And I have to admit this week, I actually felt like I was, I was getting to the point where I was actually running and not just surviving. So yeah, well, no, it's been a good week. So more of the same next week, really. It's the final run into uh, the Swansea try. I haven't really thought about how I'm gonna taper or anything like that, or if I'm even gonna bother. It's only a sprint distance. Might just have a couple of days off, but generally speaking, do you know the net result of all this? These kind of box ticking exercises are swimming these distances and all these kind of things. So I'm just very, very happy. Mm -hmm. 